Hi, this is a demonstration video of a Federal Signal 2130 and the, and the setup. First, I'll do the setup first, how everything works. This siren is running on four car 12 volt batteries. And this is the power switch, how it can actually turn it on. I mean, the service switch to power up the controller. I'm sorry about that. Off. Okay, anyway. Uh, and this is the. Uh, these light switches. The one on the left controls the rotator, and the one on the right is the siren chopper. And here's the FC controller. Here's how everything is set up. It's connected to the motor starters and the main board. The main board itself is bad, so it has been wired differently. I can show you if I if yeah. If this is one of the wires that we wired on to to try to. Well, I'm trying to figure out where the other wire is that we wired. Um. It's, it's, yeah, it's, right, it's right around here, but anyway, you won't know what's part, certain part is bad on this. It was struck by lightning and it's damaged on the FC board itself. Oh, here it is. It's hard to see. Let me see. It's hard to see with the little LCD screen. Yeah, here it is. The very middle. That's what's bad. Sorry for the blurry. That's, but that's, that's the problem. The cost a lot of money to replace the board, so we're not getting it replaced anytime soon. The one wants to cost over a thousand dollars in brand new, uh, probably three thousand dollars or two thousand dollars, if I'm correct. And I'm sorry, what's getting in the camera lens? That's the windproof screen getting into the lens. Anyway, I'll just show the. Here's the rest of it. We walk back. The trailer hasn't been on the road since it's only one time with with the siren. That's it. Because the tra the tra we haven't been taking the siren out often. So it I. Anyway, uh, I'll show how everything works, how I'll turn on the stuff. Here's it. I'm gonna turn this on. Um, powers it up. See, there's the lights. Now I'll just show the rotator. One of the motor starts click because it's flipping the rotator on. And now, a, bu a bump. If you're not, if you don't know that much about 2000 with Durries, the chopper is located behind this, behind this. I don't have time to remove the screws to show where it is, so it's it's quite it has a mall free chopper, but I mean it, it's kind of like a mall free chopper. But it's all new, designed, redesigned chopper. I mean it's not recently. It was just that's how it is. Oh, anyway, about the, these car batteries. 
this is not recommended to use on your like on your 2030 or any battery backup siren because the batteries may explode but these batteries won't explode the, re the recommended batteries to use are um, deep cycle batteries the reason why we're using these batteries because we don't want to spend the money for the deep cycle batteries. The batteries cost a lot to purchase, so we got these batteries instead. They're still great batteries. In the cold, they still they don't die. Just kept, they, they, they still work. So I had a wash this inside there before, but it's gone. I'll just show that everything inside. If you, if you don't know any sounds like dirty. Yeah, there. Was, oh yeah, if you see some of the sticks, just, there was a bird nest. No worries. I, I, we, the nest was our. There were no birds at the time I tested the siren. When there was, when the nest was once inside, it's been since removed. When, when we first noticed it. So, um, try to figure out what I can talk about. If, oh, if you're wondering how I got this, I got this last year from my seller. Well, it was given to me because he liked my interest in sirens. Only found this on eBay for auction about a hundred dollars or less. I forgot the exact price. But it was over a hundred dollars. So I was so lucky to get this thing when I uh, another story or. Added, I'll add that to the story. Um, we tried to get this bid the auction. We actually lost because somebody outbid us. But three weeks later, after the auction ended, so well, my mother. I'm not very good about stories, but my mother emailed the seller. If the buyer doesn't get the siren, please let us know, and we can try to buy it. Three weeks later, after the. After the auction ended, the seller emailed us saying, you want the siren still? And we immediately said yes, and the seller allowed us to buy it. This, If you're wondering where this came from, it came from Simmel, Alabama. It's quite close. Well, not too close. It's not bad how far it is. So I am officially the first person to obtain a pair of single Jazz 130. This thing works really good. If you want, if you want to see a video of it running, link is in the description. So I do want to explain a lot more stories about how we managed to get this thing wired up because it was it took us a long time to originally took it to Jeb to get this wired up. So that's so what he did the wiring and stuff. But but all this wires we did as instructed by him. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I usually test this weekly then or almost weekly, the neighbors nearby do not mind it. So here's the location. There are no neighbors around the trees. There's oh, there's a, there are, there's some behind the house, behind the trees, but all the other neighbors are deep behind these trees, way deep. And I right hear no, no neighbors are. Behind these trees, if it, the camera that you've wondered where I videoed the siren from the last test near the deer's hunting stand, I don't, I can't see it from my view. It was somewhere over here, camera. So, so, eh.
All right. I think that's all. Thanks for watching. Qu any questions and comments, feel free to comment. And I'll, if questions, I will get back with the questions when I can. I'm usually busy now.